Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Axe, and today I'm going to show you a browser that lets you cast almost any video from Android. Now the Chrome browser for Android lets you cast a lot of web videos to Chromecast, but some sites actively block this feature, and others just have screwy video players that conflict with the casting functionality. For instance, Instagram videos won't cast when you view them on the web, and the official app doesn't allow it, and that's a big one. So developer Martin Kanespower decided to create an entire web browser that's designed specifically for sending videos to your Chromecast, and the end result is that you can now play almost any web video directly from Android. To top that off, this even works with Fire TV, so there's a lot to like here. The app itself is called Cast Controller, and it's available for free on the Google Play Store. So search it by name to get it installed, or you can use the link in step 1 in my full tutorial. Now when you first launch the app, you'll be greeted by a setup guide, but that's what I'm here for, so I'll dismiss that one. From here, the concept is pretty simple. You just use Cast Controller as a web browser, then it'll help make sure that the videos can be played on your Chromecast. And as a rule of thumb, if it'll play on the mobile site, it'll play on your Chromecast. So navigate to any website using the address bar at the top of the screen, but to demonstrate, I'll go with Instagram. From here, just select the cast icon in the top right corner, then select your Google Cast device or Fire TV to connect. Once you've done that, the developer suggests that you play any videos that you'd like to cast, just to make sure the browser picks up on them. But to be clear, when you press the regular play button in the embedded player, it'll only play on your phone, not your TV. So once you've done that, you'll notice that the button in the bottom right corner turns orange. This means it found the video, so just tap the floating action button at the bottom of the screen. Right after that, the video will start playing over on your TV, and you can use the controls on the phone to play, pause, and seek. So it's a pretty standard casting experience, but the big difference is that this will play almost any video. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.